Today, the 498th uh, Combat Sustainment Support Battalion activated the 339 Quartermaster Bulk Petroleum Company. Uh, we also conducted an assumption of responsibility and an assumption of command ceremony in addition to that. So we built a new company uh, and activated that company here on the pen today. Uh, we got here in February and we've been receiving personnel and equipment ever since uh, this date. Right now we're at 103 personnel. We look to get to 176 and establish an uh, awesome footprint out here at Camp Humphreys. And we'll, we'll be providing world-class logistics sustainment support out here with uh, Class 1 water and fuel support to the peninsula and area support. It all started in June with me, the commander, and uh, one other NCO. And now we're at 105 personnel. We're receiving soldiers every day. One of the things I will tell you about this company, the leadership is solid and the soldiers are motivated. And if you've got good leadership and motivated soldiers, uh, they can't fail. They can never fail. And the mission set is important. It's uh, game changing. I think I put that out in the speech and that it will, uh, this company will stretch the combat capability across the pen significantly. And so there, it's a game-changing uh, cha game capability and a capability that uh, is sorely, sorely needed here on the pen. So for the future, right now we plan to be fully mission capable sometime around February of 2016. Uh, at that time there will be about 176 strong. Uh, we'll have uh, class one water support and class three support and we'll also have the IPDS system, which is an inland petroleum distribution system, uh, which will be the only one here in theater. So we'll have a, a huge asset able to lay down fuel support and pipelines throughout the Korean Peninsula. I'm excited for the future for the 339 Quartermaster Company. Um, the training we have scheduled, as well as getting some training on the IPDS system in Fort Pickett, Virginia, hopefully in 2016 or 2017. Now again, I'm just, I'm proud to have been a part of it, proud to serve. These guys, uh, these soldiers, they're motivated, uh, they're ready to, to do their job and their mission, and I, I couldn't be prouder to be their commander.